So fall is here, which means we start to cool off. But if you think about it, this past summer made a lot of us kind of hot beyond just the temperatures. Yeah, we're talking about hot under the collar because it seems like road construction projects were everywhere. They left us frustrated, all of us. But down in Hastings, I found a way to blow off some steam. We make Mighty Tonka trucks so tough, we guarantee them for life. When That's you're a kid, time. it's fun to play with heavy equipment. Kid, my first truck was a Tonka. But for an adult, that heavy equipment can leave you stuck at one of our many road construction projects and turn into a major headache. So what do you do? If you can't beat them, join them. Welcome to Extreme Sandbox. I've got my safety vest on, my headsets. Go out and have some fun, Jeff. Then you're going to step on the tracks and then all the way up and have a seat. Let's extend the stick out. So left hand forward. We're going to extend that stick slow oh, and yeah. steady. It's funny. Most people think I came from construction. I'm like, nope, I'm just a big kid at heart. So the story is pretty simple. We were driving by a construction site years ago, and I've got three boys. And my kids were looking out the window saying, Dad, wouldn't it be fun to go play in that stuff? That was the birth of Extreme Sandbox. So go take another scoop. Okay. My background, I was in retail. I was worked for Target. I worked downtown. Uh, I sat in a cubicle and, you know, I loved my job there, but I just dreamt of doing something more and different. But that's kind of how, you know, I know what it's like to be in that world. So I love the fact that I have a job now that I get to play for a living. Then came his big break. You know, we had the opportunity to go on Shark Tank earlier this year, which was huge for us, put us on the national stage. Uh, so it's been great to be able to share this experience, kind of my entire journey, and we have just exploded in growth. We've more equipment, larger facilities, and now we're adding sites around the U.S. And now his little idea has become big business. When we started the business, you know, we thought it'd be middle-aged men that were coming out here to play. I, I've been blown away. I, my demographics initially, I threw them out the window. We go down to 14. Our oldest is 94. Or somebody like me who's never operated one of these things before. What is this thing worth anyway? How much is <laughs> A lot. No, tell me, 175,000. <clears throat> We're running nope. a special today though, $100 <laughs> off if you want to buy one. This is actually trickier than it looks. Right about there is good, a little bit more. See, I'm gonna need to know how to dig a big hole like this if Ian Leonard acts up. We... <laughs> <laughs> Just a warning. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ultimately I want you to push it forward. I want it all the way extended. Now, Jeff, let's go right hand right as fast as you want. Oh, now do your victory spin here. Yahoo! <laughs> the excavator rodeo here. Yee! <laughs> the Extreme Sandbox folks even incorporate one of my favorite games. Have you ever golfed using a 26 ton excavator? No, but what? Anybody, anybody who's watched me play probably thinks I need some kind of help. <laughs> Okay, you feel good about your lineup here? Yeah. Three, two, one, go. Go, 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 as hard as you can, as hard as you can. Boom! Whoa! It hit the fairway. <laughs> yeah, it did. <laughs> all right, Jeff, three points of contact all the way up. They also have bulldozers to scrape away your traffic tension. This would take care of traffic very well. There have been a few days this summer I wish I had this thing. I know, right? Slowly take your foot off the foot pedal and you will start moving. You are now driving a bulldozer, my friend. Oh, cool. Plenty of power to pile up the dirt. Push that all the way up the hill till you run out of dirt. And the big finish? Keep breathing, Jeff. <laughs> a balancing act. On your right hand side, you've got a handle right here? Yes. I would go ahead and hold that. And then up. Oh, Whoa! <laughs> and over. Whoa! down and come to a complete Okay. Nice Woo! Oh, that's a rush. You know, you're not that high in the air, but that heavy equipment underneath you makes you think you're looking straight right? up like this. And it really is a teeter-totter effect there. My heart dropped just watching you come down <laughs> it's there. It's a ball, though. They're down in Hastings. Yeah. And, uh, you know, he started because of the corporate world, thinking of uh, corporate team building and those kinds yeah. of things. But they'll serve the average person, you know, all the way down to age 14, as you said. I don't said. think I've heard you giggle like that <laughs> that uh, much in a long that time. That was a great so. way to release some traffic <laughs> that tension. That was awesome. Yeah.